In this chapter, we will discuss about plane figures, that is, triangle, rectangle, squares, etc. 1. Constructing a boundary of the fields in which crops are grown. 2. Measuring or comparing the size or magnitude of the field so that people are allotted suitable land. Here the first need gave rise to the concept of perimeter and the second need gave rise to the concept of area. In this chapter, we shall learn about these two concepts that are of great practical use. Topics covered in this chapter are Perimeter, Area Here we will learn the concept of perimeter. Firstly, we will describe simple closed curves. Let us take some examples. In these examples, we see that each of the curves has one or more of the following properties. Beginning and ending at same point not crossing itself, consisting of line segments only. Curves 1 and 2 are simple closed curves because these curves do not follow the property B but curve 3 is closed but not simple as it crosses itself. Perimeter Perimeter of any figure is the length of the boundary of that figure. Let us understand this concept with the help of an animation. Now let us find the perimeter of the given figure. The perimeter of the given figure is the sum of all the sides that is 2 plus 5 plus 5 plus 3 plus 3 plus 8 which is equal to 26 centimeters. Here we will discuss about perimeter of a rectangle. Perimeter of a rectangle is the sum of the lengths of all its sides. Perimeter is equal to AB plus BC plus CD plus DA equals to length plus breadth plus length plus breadth equals to L plus B plus L plus B equals to 2 into L plus B. Length L is equal to the half of the perimeter minus breadth. Breadth B is equal to the half of the perimeter minus length. For example, here we will learn about the perimeter of a square. Square is a rectangle whose lengths and breadths are equal Therefore, all the formulae used to obtain the perimeter of a rectangle are applicable to obtain the perimeter of a square. Perimeter is equal to AB plus BC plus CD plus DA equals to L plus L plus L plus L equals to 4L equal to 4 into side. One side of a square is equal to one fourth of perimeter. For example, here we will discuss about perimeter of an equilateral triangle. Consider an equilateral triangle with each side equal to a centimeter. Perimeter of this equilateral triangle is equal to AB plus BC plus CA equals to A plus A plus A equals to 3A centimeter. Thus, perimeter of an equilateral triangle is equal to 3 into length of a side. Perimeter of a regular figure is equal to number of sides multiplied by length of a side. 